Hello everyone, welcome to my review show. So I'm here at Subway because I'm going to do one of their new subs on their sub series. Uh, I'm going to do the Meatballer. Uh, I put up a, a question of what you want me to review next and that seemed to be the most popular one. Um, so yeah, the Meatballer. I've had the Meatball sub before. It's, it's pretty good a, a long time ago. Uh, but now it's called the Meatballer. Something new. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what's all on it, but uh, let's head in, grab it, and come back and review it. All right. Let's go. All right, everyone. We got our uh, meatballer, one of the new subs here at Subway. So from what I read, it's the um, meatball sub, but they add pepperoni and looks like some fresh mozzarella cheese so big thick pieces of mozzarella two of them I just got the six inch and um, they recommend it on the uh, I think it's the herb and cheese bread so that's what I got it on and then I added uh, lettuce and uh, green peppers so I don't that doesn't come um, on it unless you add it but you can add whatever you want onto the sub so it's pretty much yeah meatball sub uh, marinara sauce pepperoni and then it's that mozzarella cheese and um, the six inch we're looking at 839 that's quite a bit I remember the just the meatball sub used back in the day used to be like five bucks or something like that uh, then I also saw there I think it's a new cookie here at Subway at least I don't think I tried before the caramel brownie cookie and um, hopefully that doesn't melt it's quite hot in the car right now but let's give this a, a try probably not the best sub to be eating in a car but here it is the meatballer from subway on the sub series so it looks like the marinara sauce quite a bit on here it's dripping out of it that all I got was pepperoni and mostly lettuce let's try again hmm there's the meatball and I got a piece of that cheese that's it's pretty good cheese but it's nice and uh, stringy. I recommend uh, toasting your your sub. It's not bad. I haven't had the meatball in quite some time. The added pepperoni. Oh, there goes the meatball. The added pepperoni is pretty good. That's really that cheese that adds to it. It's, it's decent. Is it worth $8.39? Probably not. I do like the pizza sub, which is pretty much what this is. You just added the meatballs. If it was just regular cheese, not a high score. But with that cheese, I'll give it a... I'll give it a 6.5 out of 10. Maybe a little bit higher if it was a bit cheaper. But yeah, not too bad. Marinara sauce. Decent. I think it's just probably their pizza sub sauce. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried the uh, meatballer and what you thought. Or if any of these other sub series there's 15 of them uh, i did the teriyaki crunch which was pretty decent I did a review on that if you want to check that out yeah 6.5 i think is pretty fair let's try this uh caramel brownie cookie you see chunks of caramel there then i guess the cookie is the brownie nice and soft Subway usually does pretty good cookies. I like it. 
nice glass of milk, oat milk, almond milk. Um, yeah, I'm gonna give this, I'll give this a seven out of 10. Still think the white chocolate macadamia nut is my favorite, but this one's good. All right, yeah, so the meatballer, not too bad, 6.5. Let me know in the comments below if you tried it and any other subs. And uh, thanks for watching. I'm going to finish this off. And uh, yeah, check it out on the next review coming soon. Bye for now.